Welcome back to the Sorry Girls. In our previous episode, we visited the Aviona Center. Here we learned what the often teenage mothers and their newborn babies need from the center and specifically the mother's lounge. We were tasked with turning this outdated room into an irresistible space. So we want this to be a room that they can't resist. Uh, I will take that brief. We came up with a plan. We sourced new and thrifted furniture and decor, moved out all of the existing furniture, painted, and even started bringing in some larger pieces. In today's episode, we're going to finish the space and reveal the room to some of the staff. And a big thank you to Best Buy for sponsoring this video. Oh my gosh, so many colors now. I was literally just gonna say, you thought we had all the colors? Nope. No, this is good. This is making it less baby. Yeah. We want a little bit of baby, but like still like fun mom, you know? Yeah, I'm not a regular mom, I'm a cool mom. <laughs> I was waiting for that line to be busted out at some point in this makeover. <laughs> gotcha, Becky. Here, I'll go gra grab the other lamps. Okay, I'll place the things. This. Was that it goes in between. This could just live here. The fact that this isn't even all the colors yet. <laughs> like we saw that ottoman, which is a new color. That's right, and the pillows. But I think when you're going this type of style, like the more color the better. I think these can be spaced out a little more. They feel squishy together. I know, it just means that then it feels squishy here. I mean, I feel like it's more of a moment there. Yeah. Oh, well, we have the mirror that's going to go like this. Yep. Other than that, we don't really have anything for here, but we have those poofs, which could stack up, but mm -hmm. also maybe... I don't need to fill everything also. No, we don't. Later. This is a final touch. <laughs> we're kind of skipping... I don't know why we're worrying about it We're now. skipping steps, but it's because we wanted to figure out this furniture placement. I think we should do the vinyl and those cabinets. Those are the two ones I'm just not sure. Yes. Uh, it's getting. I think, yeah, I think don't peel off. I mean, do everything. But I what think, do you think? I think don't peel off everything at once. No, never. Just kind of do a slow remove as you go. But truthfully, I don't know. Oh my God, this is hard. <laughs> it's hard. And it's really hot in here. And yeah. That's yeah. All. I'm doing what you told me not to do. What was that? I'm ripping it all off. Also, just so you guys know, Becky's a little bit more patient than I am. <laughs> I have weird perfectionist tendencies, but I choose when I to drop them. I'm just using my library card for this. Thank you, City of Toronto, for this opportunity. Um, don't worry, I've blocked out my number so you guys can't place holds under my account. <laughs> Having fun isn't hard. Ooh. Oh my goodness, she knows something! Putting on decals isn't hard when you've got a library card. We decided to do decals instead of painting this. Just it's a different look. Like paint looks like paint sometimes. Um, and once we put the chrome middle on this, you're really gonna see why decal was preferred. Also, we just didn't want to do anything too permanent to these doors since they are original, original wood. We didn't want to paint on top of them. Hey, me jumping in on the voiceover here. Is it decal or is it decal? Wait, what did I say? Decal? But which one is Isn't it? Isn't one's American and one's Canadian? <laughs> that I don't know. Hello, good morning. Kelsey in the background. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we are back here again, um, just picking up basically where we left off yesterday. This is our door, and she looks beautiful! We're very happy. So now we're gonna move on to this corner over here. We got some cabinets that need to get mounted on the wall. So let's just get to. Okay. 
That's why I'm... Oh my god, that looks so good. <laughs> Okay, orange shelf time? Orange shelf time. Orange shelf time. It's just shelf, shelf time. Shelf built in days. It really is. Crazy. What are you doing? <laughs> well, we need to figure out where this sconce goes in order to figure out where the bookshelf goes. Right? What's well, happening? Also, we were gonna paint all of these black accents, but we actually have a lot of them. And I think it ties things, it's just, everything doesn't need to be bright and colorful. Like we have a lot of bright colors, so. We're mature. Yeah, so like this. <laughs> Enter Nina. <laughs> the stand-in. <laughs> Nina repressing her role as the stand-in. <laughs> just sit, put your body off to the side. I'm gonna get In her new role, the stand out. <laughs> I mean, I liked the book. <laughs> I liked the bookshelf when it was centered on the wall. Can I see that a little lower? <laughs> I think it's great, guys. To make our custom acrylic shelf, we're using these glass shelf clips to hold our long shelf pieces into place and to mount the entire piece to the wall. We love a good double duty. We will link these below for you. Look at look at how it shines on the wall. It looks it's so like it's cool. lit. It's so weird. Okay, shall we? Please. <laughs> I don't know, is Lily? it gonna work? I don't know. Ah! <laughs> so cute. That's awesome, that looks really good. And guys, I don't know how we didn't realize this, but this is a, like a white, like a clear board, like a white board, like you can write on it. We have so many huge ones in our house. We do it all the time and like, this whole time we were just thinking bookshelf and I was like, this could be like bookshelf and note, bulletin board vibe. I'm so proud of this DIY. And it was so easy. It looks good. Don't tell anybody, it was so easy. Full tutorial on our website. Probably. So we have a blog if you didn't know. Okay, it's time to call it a day. Okay, okay. see you tomorrow. Okay, Today is a really exciting day because we have Emily here from the Best Buy Geek Squad helping us set up all of the tech in the space, which I'm super thankful for because Becky's out today. So I'm very happy to have the extra hands. We're talking Sonos soundbars and speakers, Google Nest Hub, Nintendo Switch, smart lights, Samsung Frame TV. I had so much fun shopping for these young women that are going to be enjoying this space. A lot of these things I actually have in my own space, so I know how much tech and even some really cool smart lighting can change your space. Speaking of, while Emily works on that, I need to get some lighting up on the walls so that we have lights to install our smart lighting into. Oh, yeah. uh, so I just wanted to confirm the height with you now. Yeah. This is like a rough sort of outline, but mm -hmm. this is the height of the TV where the bottom of the yellow tape is the bottom of the TV and the top is the top of the TV. Mm -hmm. um, ideally, you want your eyes to gravitate towards the center. So the center is around here yeah. where my thumb is. Which I we knew this was like a little bit high. Mm -hmm. Obviously, we want to cover this. Yeah. So I think, can I just see from yeah, the top sure. of this? Yeah. I think we should go a little bit lower. Okay, yeah, sounds good. While Kelsey is over at the center getting the tech set up, I'm back at the office finishing up the last of our DIY projects, including sewing this custom seat cushion for our window bench. I don't know how I'm gonna stuff this. <laughs> it's so long. Corduroy and foam are the least slippery materials. This is not budging. I will report back later. Oh, are 
you okay on that side? Yeah. Okay. So if you were to press the power button, yeah, uh, just right here. You press it once, and it turns into like basically a picture. Oh, that's so cool! Yeah. <laughs> and so to pull the TV out, do uh, you want it like kind of diagonally or? Um... Yeah. So like if we were sitting here, yeah. I would love to know. To the left. Yeah. yeah. That. That's awesome. I feel like Becky was thinking lower, but I'm thinking higher. Yeah, so an interesting thing about the Samsung uh, ecosystem is that it has a gaming port. So we've got HDMI 4 right here, and there's mm -hmm. a little game right next to it. So for the Nintendo Switch, just for the optimal gaming performance, I'm just going to plug it into the gaming HDMI. Okay, perfect. Oh, it's, yeah. It's not blue and red. Yeah, no, this is, this is like the... OLED version. Yeah. So it it basically has the nicest screen. I think you got like some some cute little Joy Cons here. Yes. I, I love the color there. <laughs> we got so many extra Joy Cons because you know group play. Got our Mario games and everything. <laughs> they're, they're gonna love this. They're I like, know, <laughs> right? Yeah. Who couldn't? Geek Squad was truly a superstar at taking this makeover to the next level. They were able to suggest the perfect tech for our new moms and babies, from sound machines to create the perfect naptime atmosphere, to air purifiers to keep the air clean and safe. And on top of that, they helped get all the smart tech connected and running to the Wi-Fi, as well as mounting our new TV to the wall an often difficult task that you certainly don't want to do wrong. A big thank you again to Best Buy for partnering with us on such a very special project. Take off the blue. It's time. <laughs> Middle or high? High. Middle feels like kish. High feels elevated. So for cabinets here, obviously, well maybe not obvious, but I want to do some handles. And I actually found these. I didn't even paint them. They came this color. It's called chartreuse, and I had to turn to Becky and say, is chartreuse green? I did not know that. Chartreuse means bright ass green. <laughs> It's giving Ryobi. They tie in nicely to our spray painted light, obviously. I don't think we have a lot more of this color, but just enough, just enough bright green. And a smart hack is to make a template with any scrap wood so that you don't have to measure every single time. You just make your template once and then you're good to go. So I don't know if I came up with the idea and then found it on my Pinterest board or Pinterest gave me the idea. But either way, I want to do a colorful film on portions of the window just for fun. To install this window vinyl, I'm cutting pieces either exact or just slightly larger than my window pane size. My window has already been cleaned, but I'm actually using a dish soap and water mixture on the window before I apply the adhesive film in order to reduce any bubbles that may form and allow me to move it around a little bit more easily. Once squeegeed and smoothed out, I can use a utility knife to make it a perfect fit. Honestly, if you have a glass door in your shower and you're not squeegeeing it, I judge you so hard. <laughs> Unless you have the most baby water ever and it's not hard at all, or I don't know, but... It's also the soap. Yeah, it's everything. Like, you gotta squeegee your shower. Go change right now. 
Oh, that's so nice. Put this so I can turn it down a little. Yeah. Orange, orange? Like go closer? There, yeah. So everything's done? Yeah, everything everything's finished with the TV. And then I can, um, I'll set up our own art later. Yeah. Tomorrow. Yeah. So really quick, uh, one of my favorite features of the Samsung remote is the solar charging That's so battery. Cool. Yeah, you just put this uh, next to a window or even in interior lighting and it just charges. So Emily just left. She did an amazing job. It was so helpful to have her here with us today so that she could just do what she does best, which is set up tech fast and efficiently. And I could finish up some of those key pieces of this makeover. Are we loving the windows? Can we get a subscribe for the windows? <laughs> um, but I do actually still have a few more things from Best Buy. Um, Best Buy doesn't just sell tech. So these are kind of more final touches, which is for tomorrow. Hello! Oh my god. Orange. Orange. I know. I love it. Do you? It's really good. I think it's sick. It's really cool. Talk about doing things that people don't always do, you know? And I wasn't sure because like the muntins are like in the glass, right? Yeah, yeah, so it's, it's a like, fake. It's fake, but it looks so real. Yes, yes. Anyways, I've made us a cushion. That looks Brought sweet. us some more cushions. You're cushion queen today. I'm a cushion queen today. Okay, um, yeah, I did. we did a lot, but there are still some final touches, which I would love your help with. Absolutely. Okay. I would actually love to just make sure that this fits. Yeah, <laughs> I would love that too. I would love it if that fit. Oh, thank goodness. We. Oh, it's, it's actually Perfect. It, I don't say that a lot about like things that I do. Like it's so good. Look at you're just reading back there. It's your little cozy corner. I love it. I love it. Okay, let's make it cozier. <laughs> Becky found this artwork and artist on Etsy. Jenny Liz Rome has some beautiful original pieces that really work well together if you need more than one print, which is what we did here. Okay, listen to this Hubble machine. Oh my goodness. It's so precious. Serenity now. Is this everything you could have ever wanted? My little baby soul is like so snoozy right now. This, this is it. Is your baby soul ready to reveal? The baby soul is so ready to reveal. Okay, I know that they're standing outside that door because I can hear them. I don't know why I'm so nervous. Maybe because the stakes feel really high for this one, but I feel like more nervous. There's so many people that are like, that use this room. Yeah. There's not one person that like we're revealing it to. And also this is like kind of a funky colorful space. And we put orange all over the windows, but I don't know if you guys are seeing this light that it's casting. It's doing everything my head envisioned it to. <laughs> I love this space. I think it's really cool. And I think we should bring them in. I think so. I'm going to turn off the music. Yeah. We need to go into epic music now. I'm going to go get them. OK. Are your eyes shut? You ladies yes. ready? Yes. OK, I'm going to have you walk in with your eyes closed. Just be careful. All right. Keep coming. Keep coming. All right. OK, you guys remember what the space looked like before? Oh, yeah. Envision it in your mind. Mm -hmm. We wanted to create a space that was Irresistible. All right. <laughs> and I hope we did just that. Open okay. your eyes. Check it out. Woo! <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh 
Oh my God, this looks amazing. This is fantastic. Wow. Oh my God, this is so welcoming. And it feels like a home. God. This is lovely. <laughs> oh my goodness, the queer. Look, thank you. you. Oh my God. Oh, oh this oh. is amazing. Guys, I'm gonna want to spend all my time up here now. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is fantastic. I remember what the room looked like and what I'm seeing is such a change. What do you think the mothers are gonna think that? Oh, they're gonna love this. Space. This is just gonna show them how much you know we care about them mm -hmm. while they're. Yeah while they're here and while they're going through their, you know, this new challenge in their lives. I mean, this is gonna show love. Yes, and like you said, I think, you know, finding that sense of community can be hard and it might be a tendency to shy away in their spaces that they have here, yes. but I hope that this room can build that community mm -hmm. and only mm -hmm. make them stronger moving forward. I think it will. It's, yeah. it's a hundred times percent different from what it was. <laughs> this looks like a lived-in area. Yeah, I mean, honestly, it was such an honor to be able to come in and do this, so thank you for letting us come. Mm -hmm. thank, you. thank you. Like, everything you do here is so wonderful, and you know, when we saw the before, we, we were just like, this place needs, like, some love, you said. Mm -hmm. You heard us, and you... <laughs> you delivered. delivered. You delivered. You know? Love personified. Yeah. You've exceeded all our expectations, I think. And, oh, then some. and and the yes. presence of books, yes, have, yes, you know, for the babies yes. and oh. the different lighting. Oh, wow! There's yeah. actually all oh. the lights are they have smart lights in them. So, uh, hey Google, make it cozy. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> the best part about this space is how it can totally transform with different types of lighting. We can create a dimmed and relaxing environment perfect for nap time, or it can become a fun hangout spot for the moms after the babies have gone to sleep with some fun, colorful LED lighting. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing because subscribing means that we can continue to do makeovers like this.